Welcome back to Portal 2. I am Jimmy Joe. Um, look at all this glass building the, the test chamber for us. Oh no, they're not glass, it's just pan four panels. There we go. Okay. Geometry test. So, this one's actually really easy. You know how I'm going to live forever, but you're going to be dead in 60 years? I mean... Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Yay! Presents. I like presents. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. <laughs> That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. But right here, a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, what does a neck-bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... <laughs> oh, wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh, wait. It says she has a medical degree. In fashion. From France. <laughs> Is anyone there? No. Who are you? I don't hate you. Hey. Are you still there? Wow, that's awkward. No, don't you me, don't you me, don't you me! Okay, good. Alright. So we got what? Let's 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 turn this to blue. Turn this to orange, so all I have to do is right click. So. Okay. <laughs> Just everybody look at the wall. Everybody look at the wall. Nothing to see here. There. All good. Oh crap. Uh, 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 uh. Alright. Please put me down. Just gotta take care of these real quick. Ow, ow. Alright. Good enough. I'm going through the I list saved of as many as I could. Cryogenic storage. I managed to find <coughs> two with your last name. A man and a woman. So that's interesting. <coughs> it's a small world. We don't even know our last name. All we know is that our name is Shell. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. <gasps> our parents? Ow. So that, that does hurt. Okay. Well, that's, that's fine. Hi. They did change it so that they don't shoot at the uh, the glass anymore, which is nice. What's this? All right. Oh, I remember this. They die. I feel so bad. That's the only way to do it. 
Pretty sure lasers also go through um, windows. Yeah. Oh, they're so sad. I feel so bad. Poor little turrets. All exploded and stuff. <laughs> I don't know why I always turn around in the elevator, because it always puts you, like, facing the exit of the elevator afterwards. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. <laughs> but, you know how it's like... It's kind of interesting that, uh... That, um... Even even in a game that loads something for you like that, it doesn't. Oh. Uh. Okay, so that's the door. Oh, I see. Okay, 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 okay. So we do this. Then we. Oop. Do this, and then we do this, which lowers the door, and then when we change the the portal, it'll fall onto the button, open the door for us. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. But yeah, it's it's just uh, like how things are ingrained on us. It's kind of funny. You walk into an elevator and usually your first instinct is to walk in and then turn around. Generally, it's because the buttons are there. So you don't really have to worry about it. But it's, it's funny that I, I, I do it instinctually in a video game that automatically puts me... Initiating surprise in three, two, forward, one. I made it all up. Yay! Surprise. Confetti! Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Oh, whatever. Can I go through here? I can go through here. Do I want to go through here? Is that a turret, or is that a thing? Hmm. That's a turret. That's a beam. That's a turret. Okay. I need the block. Oh, that... Okay. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Okay. Button does. All right. All right. Um, like this. Okay. Now I have that. So. Now I have those. Just give me one of those. Oops. Whoops. That's not where I wanted that to go. Well, that's fine. Now I can grab this. Um, then... Let me do over here. That goes like that. I think. Right? How many other things do I need? Ow. Uh... Okay, the other one has to be there. Oh! 
Oh. Alright. <clears throat> I know how to deal with this. Uh, this one. This one. This will make it much easier. There. All done. Now I can do the other thing. Activate. And then put this over here. Activate. I feel awful about that surprise. Tell you what. Let's give your parents a call right now. Wait. Oh, right. Parents who are trying to reach, do not love you. Please hang up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. Maybe they worked at the phone company. I don't know. Who knows? If we were abandoned at birth. Talk my way onto the old nanobot work crew rebuilding the shop. They are a reason to... I know, Jerry! No, I'm on a break, mate. I'm on a break. Ah! Just hang in there for five more... What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site <laughs> should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. Aww. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Five more chambers? Man, how am I ever going to finish five more chambers? Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while, so I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. Where is... Okay. 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 So what? Oh. Two. One. Can I even get up there? Uh, I think I have to do it this way. And then, whoops. Shoot. Okay, well. There we go. Uh, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. This first. Oh, I keep doing this wrong. <laughs> okay, there's one. Now I need to... get another one. Put this one... directed over there. Yeah, okay, that's right. <coughs> Then I have to get up there. Where am I? Whoa, okay. That's number two. And then number three is over there.
Oh, uh, okay. <coughs> Oops, I did it wrong. Oh, that's right, there's turrets up there. Alright. Uh, oh. Come on. So, this. Okay, close enough. Wait, where'd it go? Didn't it fall? Oh, flew. Okay. Um, I guess I have to destroy those turrets. Okay. Alright. Oops. Right? Yeah, okay. Perfect. We did it. I thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Well, we're going to call it here. Thank you for watching. Um, come back next time for more Portal. And like, comment, and subscribe. Right now. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right. The facility is completely operational again. All right. Okay. So, we need to have three beams. Okay. This has to reflect now. Has to reflect this one. Oh, but I can only have two portals. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. Yep, 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 yep. So, ow. Let's go like this. So then I do this. And this. Ha ha ha! See how they all make noise? Like, they're, they're all doing, uh, like a song. I think these test chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. Alright, well, this is going to be the last part of this episode. Come back next time for more, uh, Portal. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And come back next time for more Portal. Bye!